What is going on? How's everybody doing? Guess what we're here for today? Well, I got a package in the mail. Now, normally what we did is we bought a bunch of little subscriptions that give us different little candies and treats throughout all over the world. And well, I always talk about the 90s. Like, I don't want to say I'm a 90s baby, but I, I was born in the 70s. I'm old as shit. Not the point. The point is, is that a gentleman that is a hazer had sent me this. And of course, we're going to do a little bit of taste testing because I know what a lot of these are going to taste like. It's just, Brie does not. And I, I feel, am a 90s baby though. You are. That's right. But you wouldn't half the toys that are in here. So not only is there little treats and hoozy what's it's in there and dingle hoppers, there's like little bouncers and parachute little toys. I'll explain that in a little bit. Let me read the letter that this gentleman sent me. First off, the guy's name is David Tufts. He was the gentleman that uh, was trying to get his hands on an Ultim Haze mod. Anyway, here we go. Hey there, Pickle Pants. That's the first thing that he sent, says on here and on the box. And then inside the box is actually a pair of Pickle Pants, which I'm not going to wear. Aww. This, as I told you in messages, was just for laughs and a small way to say thanks. When I saw these pants, I thought of you and laughed my ass off, picturing you at the shop or on a live and Brie laughing in the background. I hope you get a laugh from them and enjoy the drink. It may be the last one I looked everywhere for. It. Share the old-fashioned candy with Brie. I hope you guys like some of it. And it brings back memories from childhood. Also, I hope the tiny things for Brie are okay. It's the best I could do in a short time before sending this out. All the best to you, both, and happy holidays. Dave Tufts. So he had asked me, um, listen, Jay, I'm going to be sending you something. What does Brie like? And I said, well, Brie likes tiny things, whether that's forks, paintbrushes. It, she just likes everything tiny. So um, we're going to go through the box. There's a lot of candies. So I don't know if we'll be able to go over all of them. But for those of you that were in your young teen years in the 90s, you're going to know what a lot of these are. There's even some little toys from the 90s. I don't know if he has a shop by him that has like 90s memorabilia because that's exactly what this is. Let's go over it. Let's okay. start the box. Okay. So, in, okay. Hey, pickle pants. Okay, so in, in the box, the first thing we get is a little baby shopping cart. <laughs> How cute! No, of course, that's for Brie. That's not for me. Oh, but you have to do the seat thing. So, you pull this back and it's actually like a little seat. You see how excited she gets, and there's like a little handle for you to push. Yeah, and the wheels work and everything. Oh, okay. She also got a Mirror Book Air, which is basically a MacBook, but a mirror. Super cute. That's so little. Looks like uh, some, an extra shovel, a rake, and a hoe. Oh. <laughs> Timeless minis, little pots and pan set. If Super I need to cute. for a hamster, I'm good. Oh. All right, so let's just get into it. First off, anybody that knows what these are, these are, first off, these are absolutely monstrosity. The things that I remember are the little itty bitty dots. And you would like eat the paper too, because you didn't give a shit. But we're going to go for this. We're going to try these. Uh, again, we're not going to try everything because there is a lot. But I do want to give a huge shout out to Dave for sending this over to us and thanking him for actually finding one of these. Oh, there's a mini yo-yo in there too. And it actually works. That's what it says. He okay. found me one of these so automatically, and it's nice and chilled. Mm -hmm. So for those of you that don't know, you probably used the candies that are already wrapped. Well, you would get this in sheets, and they would come in rolls. Oh my. And what you would do is this is all candy. So. And it smells like lacquer. But let's give it a whirl. Mmm. Bye. See, she likes it. <laughs> These will all be gone in six minutes. <laughs> Very good treats. They're basically like little coated, she's gonna say. All right, time to go to move on to the next thing. You can eat those later, okay? 
All right, uh, that's one. But what's really special about this is um, this box right here. There's a lot of stuff in this box, but what's really cool is inside here is a lot of little goodies. So I, there is a lot to go over, but uh, have you ever had rock candy? Yes. You Should like I it? say no so we can eat it? Do you, uh, do you like it? Yeah. Yeah. Um, not a big fan of rock candy, but it's basically just like crystallized candies. I'm sure Brie will eat those later. Put those in there. Okay, so these are super cool. Little 90s toys. Brie got so excited when she saw what this thing could do. Basically, what you do is it has a spring and a little platform. So you push it down, and what happens is it suctions onto itself. Look at Brie. And then you let it go, and then it... Woo! Just like that. You want to do it at the same time? Here's... He doesn't work. That one's a little special. Okay, ready? Hold on. Ready? One, two, three, go! <laughs> so that's what these are, and these are really big in the 90s. Of course, Brie is going to be playing with these. I'm going to be here in suction cups for the next 20 days. <laughs> Some more rock candy. I'm sure Brie will eat all that later. There's also a little rubber ball in here. That's nice. That's nice. <laughs> There's still stuff in here. That's okay. Some of these candies, I'm not gonna, oh my God. You guys remember these? What is it? Yo. Okay, I got so crazy with this. There's a website that sells like 90s candies. I, I can't remember what it's called, but I guess they have like an overstock of it. I literally bought. They come in strips of four. I'm roughly gonna say 600 different strips. It looks like there's only one in here. and Nope, there's two. So what would you rather have? Strawberry or cherry? Uh, choices. Thank you. So, what is cool with this is... It's a Zot. It's a Zot. Now, it looks like a regular candy on the outside. Very, very typical of any kind of candy. But you suck on it. Go on. Now... It tastes normal, right? Mm -hmm. Bite it in half. Alright, there we go. Did you bite it? Bite it in half. You'll be okay. Bite it. My teeth aren't strong enough. Did you bite it? <laughs> There's sour stuff coming out. It's like fizzy. Mm-hmm. You gotta buy it. <laughs> okay. These are so good because inside of it is like a like a sour powder. And it, it fizzes all in your mouth. And if you eat enough of them, it'll actually make you foam at the mouth. This suffers, though, from that 90s cheap candy because the little pieces get stuck in your teeth. Are these six slits? Oh, dude, I hated these fucking things. The funny story is, there used to be a place in Jersey called Farrell's. And they would sell candies. And I would buy a lot of these because I always thought they were gum. But they're not gum. I promise you they're not gum. They're the exact opposite of gum. They're chocolate but they look like little mini gumballs or little candies. That was, don't open two because you're gonna be upset. We'll just share one. I was so pissed off because I, I got so many of them. My dad gave me like five bucks. So I got like, I, I don't know, 20 or 30 of these packages. Whoa. It's weird because it's sour, but it's chocolate. They're sour? Yeah, you taste the candy on the outside with the chocolate on the inside. But it's like uh, Skittles with chocolate. It's a little weird. It's I was so let down that day. I don't know what that is, but I'm definitely not eating that because that makes me feel like I'm 93 years old and I have tea and crumpets in front of me. What is it? Uh, butterscotch. Reads. Oh. That's not going to work for me. What if it's delicious? 
Tabasco chocolate. Mm. Who who thought of this? Well, oh. it's it, definitely gonna be hot. Does it smell hot? No, nope. doesn't smell like anything. Did it just filled with tab Tabasco sauce? Almost a tobacco sauce. It doesn't smell like anything. It smells like chocolate. Spicy chocolate? All of it's spicy? You should try it. You're not going to try it with me? You should try it. Come on, Brie. I'll eat it. You just, just try it first. Thank you. You ready? Yeah. We're just going to take a bite out of it or we're just going to eat the whole thing? Sounds like regular chocolate. Let's take a little bite. Ready? Okay. One, two, three. Oh my god, it's so hot. What? It's burning. What are you talking about? Oh, there it is. Oh God, oh my God, yo, oh shit. <laughs> it's like a surprise. It tasted so good off the jump. <laughs> oh my God, yo. You're so generous. I did not think that that was gonna be that bad. Thank you. It's like a fucking habanero chocolate. Did you like it? Not at all. I liked it off the jump. You guys remember Ooh, these? I love these so much. You guys remember Ooh, these? I love these so much. <laughs> you guys remember these? You guys remember Ooh, these? I love these so much. I used to play in a pool and there's a whistle and you. I Here love you the watermelon one. What flavors do we have? Where did he find this? That's the only one. Then we're gonna have to both play the same whistle. Are you okay with that? You could save it for a fun time for you. Can I open it? Yes. This is weird. I'm not gonna eat this because it's banana flavor, but I don't know what that is. Kits Kits? Oh there's, there's a banana, a vanilla. It's like a taffy, I guess. And then you got little. So this is a strawberry taffy. Do you want to share the same one, Brie, or you want to try your own? This looks delicious. It's a little, it's called Bee Baits? Batsy? Bob's, Bob's Bats? Or b b b b b bats I think that's it, b b b b bats Is it? Brie's not gonna like this, it's too hard. Maybe it's a suck on candy. Thank you. It's gonna take you forever to eat it. It's a salt water taffy. Have you ever had salt water taffy? That's not very good at all. God, that is disgusting. Taffy takes too long to eat. Oh God, that is gross. Oh, Jesus Christ. My mom always told me, if you eat something you gotta swallow it, don't spit it out. This tastes like earwax. Let's do it. Yeah, 
You know what that kind of tastes like? Cat piss. You want to try the whistle? Mm -mm. Rip rolls. They're like a gummy, gummy roll. Oh, you got it? sour. Yeah. Oh, funny. I never had it before. Oh, I wonder if it tastes like a farola. These are the best ones right here. Zot's grapes. I'm going to give these all to Brie because I know she'll eat them. Oh, but if you like the grape one, you can have it. All right, so this is what I wanted to discuss. I don't know if you guys out there have a plate on your roof. You remember these? Basically, you would get these little figurines that would have a little piece of plastic on the back. And you would unwrap the rubber band and throw them off of a roof or somewhere high. And then the parachute would catch the air and they would glide down. Occasionally, the parachute would never open, though, and it would be like a suicidal jump for the mini figurine of some sort. So, let me just pantomime right quick. I don't... I don't want to ruin it. You would take the rubber band off, and then that is his parachute there. That's nice. So you would throw him off, and then that would open like so. But as you could tell, it didn't quite open. So they were very faulty parachutes. What if we throw it really hard? Yeah, he's gonna die. What? Yeah, he's gonna die. What? You have a dead Santa on your hands. I don't want a dead Santa. You see? And here's the parachute. Oh, look at that. And then you throw them, you throw them by the base and <laughs> sort of, yeah, that's it. <laughs> What's that? Broadway strawberry rolls? Maybe it's Fruit Roll-Up before they were Fruit Roll-Up. Oh, look at how f What the fuck is that? Ooh! Three Fruit Roll-Ups all together. I have a feeling these are not going to taste very good. What if they're delicious? They oh, smell it's four. good. Sounded hard. You'll like it. Yes. Mm. Almost tastes like those real cheap fruit roll-ups that never had any flavor. Oh. Cardi. Like a like a business card? <laughs> no, Cardi fell over. Cart E. Mm. Oh, it's Cart E B. You like it? What's his name? No. No. That's not very good. Um, Nickel nips? I feel like there's no N in the beginning. Nick? Nickel nips? There's no flavors on it, so we're just gonna go for it. The first one's red, the second one's orange, the next one's yellowy green, and last so, one's blue. So, what I used to do is, I used to get the Coca Cola ones. Oh. And it's wax. So, you're not really supposed to eat it because it's, it's wax. Oh, I lied. So you kind of break it off right there. Oh, that's nice. See that? And they're made of wax? Yep. And then you Why take... Why is it wax? Now what you do is you take this, and then you bite the tip. All right? Run it off. And you spit that out. Pull it off. Yep. And I spill it. Yep. And now you just... And that is how you eat those. Um, I don't know how old this is, but however old it is, is however old this tastes. Because this literally tastes like stale, stagnant shower water. Maybe these are all collector's items and we're not supposed to be eating Yeah, I don't think we're supposed to eat any of these, honestly. They might all have an expiry date of like 1983. Some of them don't even have nutrition facts on them, so they're definitely old. <laughs> That's straight up 70s. Yeah, this one expires in 2020, my whistle pop. I don't know how to react to that. I think we'll do one more. Oh my god. What is it? I don't know, but Bree's gonna pull these socks. Woo! 
Okay, so, um, you guys remember these? These are before Lifesavers came out. What? These are the shit. They're so, square Lifesavers? Um, essentially, you get little itty bitty. <gasps> oh, oh, I love this flavor so much. Pineapple? Yes. It's the best one. So they're little hard candies, but they're really, really good. I know they still sell them, but these, oh my God, I would love them so much. I'm use a little saucer. Are they all pineapple? No. Oh. oh. I'm excited. Nice. Those are good. All right, I would go for more of this. You gotta show these. Oh, the pants. I would go for more of this, but the battery is dying, and I really want it to. It was Cardi B. I really wanted to show off the stuff that he all sent me, because it's always cool when you get stuff that we could try. On, I know Timothy sent me some stuff. Ooh. This is definitely not my size. This is more for like Bray. Um. Yeah, this is... What? Mm. Yo. Mm. Timothy had sent me some stuff, but his is more like edible. Like a marinara. Like a garlic dip. Can't do, can't do a video on that. I don't know what that is. So we got, we got this. Holy shit. I'll tell you, if anybody out there can get their hands on a case of Johnny Appleseeds or the Cherry Sours, contact me. Slowpole. Those taffies are disgusting. Clark bars are absolutely delicious. What's that? I don't know. Uh, do we want to try it real quick? Feel it. It has a, like a texture. What the fuck is that? <laughs> I don't know what that is. It's like got holes in it. Oh. It's a caramel with chocolate. That's nice. That's nice. Well, listen, we have to put all this shit up. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I know some of you wish it was longer and we tried all this, but it would literally take us three hours. Thank you for watching. And Bree, you want to sum anything up? Oh, yeah. One more. Can you do a song on these?